In this video, I'm going to show you the fastest way to manually spot quote. This scenario is great for when you have the customer on the phone and you need to get them some numbers quickly, or if you've received an email and you want to get a quick quote back to the customer. So to get started, we're going to navigate over to our truckload quoting page. From the truckload quoting page, we have our shipment information, so all we need to do to get started is type in the customer's name. Now, if it's a brand new customer that we haven't used, we could use a guest account or however you have things set up in the background. From there, I can type in the weight of the shipment, the trailer type needed, and whether or not it's a full or a partial shipment. In this case, we'll say it's a full shipment. Then I can select my origin and destination, and for the sake of speed, I'm going to type in a few well-known easy zip codes, Atlanta to Chicago. There's multiple ways to type in your origin and destination, but that's a fast way to get it done. Now once I save the shipment, the screen will populate with all my integrated tools that I leverage for quoting. At the top we can see our own historical lane data. So this number is the average based on my data within the TMS for trucking companies that I've worked with that have quoted me in the past. But I can also see DAT rate view, truck stock rate mate, freight wave sonar, and green screens. And if I need to dig a little further into some of my favorite carriers and their historical quotes, I can hit the drop down and I'll see the dates in which I was quoted and all the quotes that came in. Now if I'm on the phone with the customer, I've already got a great idea of what I'm going to pay for this shipment and I can do some quick math in order to tell them over the phone that this shipment is probably going to go for about $1950 or maybe $2000 depending on what kind of margin I believe I can get with the customer. Now what this allows me to do is quickly push for a close over the phone as a customer sales rep. Now if I want to put some official numbers onto this shipment, I can click the edit pricing add in my target buy rate of 650 based on the data that we saw on the screen and then my target sell rate or what I've quoted the customer at which is 2000 and here I can see I'm getting a 17.5 percent margin off of the shipment so I'll go ahead and save that now that the pricing is successfully saved if the customer tells me over the phone that they would like to book this shipment I can jump up to my update status module and select booked. Now the shipment is ready for the carrier reps to start their outreach to the carrier database. If the customer does not feel comfortable booking it over the phone and would like to see an official quote from me, all I have to do is jump up to my send email module, find my quote response template, And as you can see, the $2,000 that we added to the pricing is automatically pulled into the body of the email and I'm giving my customer an option to click here and book now or they can click the attachment to see the official quote sheet. Once the customer selects booked, my carrier rep team will be prompted to begin outreach and posting this load to the load boards. And that's how Ty brings all of your integrations onto one screen to help your team move quickly in the quoting process. Easy, right?